using Unreal 5 to create a game is obviously one of the better choices. Unreal 5 gives us flexibility through the blueprinting system. It allows us to handle amazing graphics through the rendering system, the lighting system, such as Lumen. Lumen technology allows proper light bouncing. If I had to say one thing in the game that really benefits from Lumen, it's player crafted spaces. In our case, it's like you build a room and you place a window and the window lets in natural light and the light will fill the room in a way that feels real. And that technology hasn't existed before. Before Unreal 5, in the olden days, you had to use what we called the LOD system. And that meant that you had to create assets at different LOD levels, so it doesn't slow down everybody's computer. With Unreal 5, we have this new technology called Nanite that breaks things down into the right amount of polygons at the right distance. So for us, as a company, this has made an amazing difference to the visual detail of the world. It allows us to create one really amazing looking cliff piece, for example, and then doesn't matter how far away or how close we place it, it performs well and it looks great. Where Unreal worked for us on June was that it was a fantastic pre-production and planning tool. On June part two, we had some very complicated scenes and we were able to pre all the way from Budapest what the light was going to be doing well in advance. It's the only tool that I've used, I, I would say, in my 25 years of shooting that is able to be used across a wide spectrum of films by different types of filmmakers. 